Okay, welcome to this bonus video called Monet in Monetizing Your Blog. And what we're going to do right now is we're going to talk about what it takes to build a marketing funnel. Now, this might not be the path that you want to go down. You might want to be build you might want to build a totally passive uh, uh, source of income, and you can certainly do that with your blog so that you set up your blog and you are basically just monetizing the traffic. You're doing something close to set it, setting it and forgetting it. But as we said before, you could be missing some income if you choose not to uh, work to build affiliate offers that are relevant to your list. And now what we'll also say here is that if you are willing to go one step further and you're getting traffic, if you choose to create your own products instead of, of splitting the difference with an affiliate, you're going to actually be able to monetize your traffic even more. And that is what you're doing with building a marketing funnel. Now obviously we have to talk first about uh, building a, a subscriber list, which is your opt-in. So the first thing that you're going to do, of course, is you're going to get people to opt-in to your course. You're going to get people to opt-in to your, to your subscriber list. Now you're going to do that through a free report with some very good content and information and for the most part you want to make sure that content is so good that it would be something that people would pay for now the logic in this is that when people see how good your content is that you gave away when you actually get ready to sell something they're going to be more willing to buy it because your first content was so good to them and beneficial to them now the next thing that you're going to do uh, in your marketing funnel and this is typical now don't take these prices and and etch them in stone you'll obviously determine what's best for your market these are just some general guidelines you want to start with an inexpensive product between seven and seventeen dollars typically you can either have some software created that makes their life easier within your niche Okay, so if you're talking about weight loss, you know, a particular kind of weight loss, maybe you want to give them have a weight loss uh, calculator uh, uh, in particular in the particular area of weight loss that you're working in, or some kind of software to make uh, what they are trying to do or trying to accomplish easier and make it more convenient. Okay, you can do that with an inexpensive product. Now you can also create a course and if you don't necessarily know how to create videos or PDFs you can just have a live course using webinar and you can do that through go to webinar and or you can do that from any of the webinar softwares where you're basically going to teach for a certain period of time maybe once a week or once every other day in case you know depending on how long your course is or how you set it up and again you're selling this product for between seven to seventeen dollars and the people that you're selling it to are on your opt-in list now of course you can also have your own affiliates to your product but when you create your own product and you monetize your blog using your product you are really taking the monetization method uh, to another level because you can also do this and do all of the other monetization that we talked about in the course before this just really takes it to another level now once you have uh, had people to go through your inexpensive product where they learn some of the information that, that they're going to need in order to be competent in what you're doing you want to do a more advanced course and typically that more advanced course you can offer it to the people who have already decided to pay the seven to seventeen dollars by offering them a more expensive course now you might say now if they paid seven to seventeen dollars why would they want to pay more for an advance well you want to make sure that you make the offer to them pretty much when they already have committed to buy your initial product so one of the best times to do that in marketing we call this a one-time offer now you'll make this offer in this advanced course 
and the advanced course should be something that they uh, that they're that they're missing something that that the first course doesn't show them something that you would really really uh, get uh, closer to them and really show them exactly how they can get started accomplishing the goal that you want now you can obviously then take the principles of the course and work with a smaller group of individuals then to really seek to help them to apply the principles to their own business and you can do that in a group coaching setting now and obviously you are not going to have time to do this for a lot of people as you would in a course but if you want to work with people in a smaller group you want to charge a little more in order to do that and you can do that through group coaching and of course um, if you want to take one person and work with them one on one obviously if you're going to spend an hour or two of your time you will want to make sure that you're compensated for that time so that you can continue uh, to be of, a, of, of quality assistance to them and if you charge too little for personal coaching you can't do that this is a marketing funnel and as you would imagine you'll get a lot of people to come through and get the free report fewer people will want your inexpensive product fewer even then will want the advanced course even fewer will want group coaching now you might only have three or four people to want the group group coaching and then of the people who are being helped in the group or even some of the other people maybe only one person will want your personal coaching and that's why the personal coaching will be more expensive now if you do a if you work with a marketing funnel you will then be able to use uh, what you have learned and be and, and you are essentially showing people how to do and you're doing it on a more intimate level and you're showing them how to do it by applying it the the more application that you're willing to help them make to their situation basically you're personalizing the instruction so the further up the marketing funnel you go or f further down the marketing funnel you will go the more application you're making to their situation this is why you're charging more because you're not just teaching you're teaching to the person you're helping that person individually and that is why it gets more expensive as you go up the marketing funnel and once you do this when you've completed a cycle you can then go back and create a brand new course or a brand new inexpensive product to start the marketing funnel all over again in the meanwhile you leave this marketing funnel in place and to continue to let it run on autopilot so that the person gets the free report they another they see the inexpensive product and they continue to see the offers on autopilot and then you are then setting up new marketing funnels with new products okay so with that thanks I hope that you have enjoyed this bonus video if you take it and you apply it you will see more money from your blog